Hello all, uh, welcome to Universal Group of Institutions, Bengaluru. Welcome to our special series on Q&A where we have been discussing the questions and answers of Civil Service 2025 Paper 1, that is the General Studies. Uh, if you have not watched our previous video where we have discussed question number 46, please go and watch it. It's a very important question as well. Uh, in this particular video session, we are going to discuss the question number 47. Consider the following statements. There are three statements that have been given here. Uh, statement number one, it is expected that Majorana 1 chip will enable the quantum computing. Yes, this has been in news as well, which has been, you know, will greatly assist with regard to the uh, quantum computing. This particular chip has been developed by the Microsoft. Okay, Majorona one chip has been introduced by Amazon Web Services. Absolutely no, this has been developed by the Microsoft and it has been in the news. The third one is the deep learning is a subset of a machine learning. Yes, deep learning is something, nothing but the way the human mind works. Deep learning through the layered, you know, network. Uh, connections or the neural network connections we try to you know understand the manner in which the brain works that is with regard to the image recognition and all where we use something called as the deep learning it simply mimics the way human brain works yes it is a subset of machine learning no doubt at all so two happens to be false i myself said so all these statements you can see here even if you don't know about the deep learning all these statements that are con containing two will be straight away removed two 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 because Majorona one chip has been developed by the Microsoft, not by the Amazon Web Services. The only remaining that remains is the C. As I said, even in my previous video, while discussing the question number 46, it might happen that even if you don't know some part of the question, we are still able to answer such questions just using something called as the common sense. But this common sense, we will be able to develop only when we keep on solving more and more MCQs every day. That's it in this particular video session. Stay tuned for our next video where we are going to discuss the question number 48.